Hello guys and welcome to another Body Stenics tutorial. If you're new to our channel, be sure to start off by subscribing and hitting the bell icon for notifications so that way you don't miss any future videos just like this one. In today's tutorial, we're going to take you guys through a deep analysis on how to achieve strict skills with perfect form in calisthenics. Body Stenics first skill we're going to analyze is the strict ring muscle up. The key to developing a strict ring muscle up is the transition. A lot of athletes fail to realize how important it is to come down slowly whilst bringing the rings inwards towards your chest as well as maintaining a false grip. These are the three key factors in developing a strong and effortless ring muscle up. Begin in a solid support position on the rings with the rings turned out and supinated. From there, you need to perform a deep dipping motion and then begin to bring the rings into your chest with control in order to slowly transition down into the hanging phase. The slower you execute this exercise, the more effective it will be in strengthening your elbow tendons and triceps. Try to always avoid any sudden falling and really focus on controlling the transition phase, whilst at the same time maintaining your false grip. Once you have mastered all these technical portions through consistent practice, you will then find it effortless to perform a strict ring muscle up all the way up and all the way down. The muscle up can become a real fun exercise as you will also be able to perform the walking muscle up variation. Now let's analyze the strict bar muscle up. What is the main difference? The false grip. The key difference is that now we are applying the false grip using a pronated wrist placement instead of a neutral wrist placement, which we have on the rings. With the bar variation, the aim is to bring the bar to below the chest height. If you manage to do this, then you will find the transition phase of the bar muscle up smooth and simple. The fact that you have to go up and over the bar is what makes the bar strict muscle up much more challenging than the ring variation. A key go-to exercise in order to develop your strict transition on the bar variation for muscle up is to perform the half transition. Come down until your elbow is in direct line with the bar and then without hesitation, push your chest forward in order to get into the dip phase to push back up. Now let's assess the strict planche push-ups. In order to develop a solid planche push-up with the body remaining in horizontal line and not breaking at the hips, requires a lot of posterior pelvic tilt strength as well as shoulder pushing strength. The first exercise in order to develop this strict pushing strength are the tuck push up entrances for reps. The aim is to maintain the flat horizontal line with the body without allowing the hips to sink below the level of the shoulders. You can also practice the same exercise on the taller P-bar setup, with the only difference being that now we're going to perform a deep range planche push-up. The same principle applies, do not allow the hips to sink down. Now let's explore another phenomenal combination skill in calisthenics, the handstand to planche transition. The handstand to planche can be performed both on the floor and also on the wide bar setup. The two key fundamentals in order to develop this skill is to obviously have a solid planche hold as well as a solid handstand hold in both narrow and wide variations. Practice the wide handstand hold and also the same variation on the floor. The key with the transition phase is to always lean at the shoulders and focus on locking in the scapular protraction engagement by engaging the lats and the chest. Do not focus on bringing your body down, rather focus on leaning downwards through the shoulders.
We hope you guys found value in today's tutorial. Be sure to subscribe so that way you don't miss the part two series of the strict skills tutorial, where we analyze strict handstand push-ups and strict skill transitions. Thanks for watching today's tutorial, guys. If you guys found value, then be sure to subscribe and also hit that bell icon for notifications. We upload a new tutorial every Wednesday and Saturday at 3 p.m. European Easter Summer Time. For those athletes who want a more in-depth approach to their calisthenics progress, be sure to get your own copy of the 100 Calisthenics Secrets book. And for an even more depth analysis on how you can progress as an all-round calisthenics athlete, be sure to get access to our exclusive Ultimate Calisthenics course. And for those athletes who want to join the Bodysthenics global family of athletes who are taking their skills and strength to the next level, be sure to apply for online coaching today in order to fast track your progress and achieve elite calisthenics status. I'm George, Bodysthenics coach. See you guys in the next video.